Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I know a lot of you guys have questions about Philip. Um, so I'm here, I'm coming here to talk to y'all about him. Why? I don't know. Anyways, Philip is still in jail. They actually reset it his last court date. He actually goes to court on the 20th. How do I feel about this? I don't even know, y'all. I'm so ready for this crap to be over with. I'm tired of dealing with this. Um, there's a lot of people here that thinks my life is easy when it's not. It's not even close to being easy. And you know, people try to compare it to having a singleton. And y'all, I have twins. It is not easy, like I said, and I have a hard time with my postpartum depression. I'm still going through that. I know it's like almost seven months in, but it's still there because one, I'm having to do it all on my own. A lot of people have questions about why I don't ask Philip's mom and all them for help. I have asked. I'm the person that usually was watching the twins or watch helping with the kids was his sister. Um, but she just had a little boy, as y'all seen in my previous videos. I asked, y'all. I asked for help. Um, she works two jobs and when she's not working, she's living her best life. Like I understand, and these are my kids. I'm not gonna sit here and beg her 24 seven to watch my kids. Philip isn't here, I had to pick up the slack. And this is my channel, so I document everything that goes on on my channel. If I'm depressed, I document it because I feel like, if I, I wanna look back on this video and be like, damn, look at me now. So I'm just documenting everything. I feel like also, when I talk to you guys, y'all like an outlet for me, I have like, of course, I have some hating ass people too, but I have some genuine people on here that I can sit back and talk to and they understand and they, they're here for me. Y'all are like a blessing. Like I said, if Philip isn't here, he won't be in court until the 20th. And I'm so stressed out about that because it's just like it's never gonna be over with. And I hate when people like Jasmine just, I see this a lot, like ask questions, ask for help ask for you know this this and that and i just be like these are my kids i can't just keep asking for help i might have to take initiative initiative and do it myself like i've been doing um sometimes i just gotta count to 10 and just be like girl calm your nerves calm your nerves they're only six two and seven months calm down <laughs> i have my moments that i get depressed i have to lock myself in the bathroom Hey girl, hey, I'm in the bathroom right now <laughs> filming this video. I'm not depressed or upset or anything, but I just decided to come in here. It's the quietest place, aside from TV and the babies in the background. But like I said, for people out there that's going through what I'm going through, a lot of people ask me for advice. I just be like, I mean, there's really nothing you can really do other than take it day by day. And that's what I do. I can't just jump into the, you know, my next day and be like, oh, it's done. I just take it, not even just day by day, I take it minute by minute, hour by hour, second by second, anything. Because if I don't, I will go crazy. <laughs> and another subscriber said, why don't I wake up early in the morning and take that time for myself? I've actually, since time changed, I have no choice. I'll wake up early and i just be like, why am I awake? So I do that, drink my tea, take my time to myself, and I'll edit. And I know people be like, there's not time to yourself editing, but that's the time I can get it done. And I feel, people be like, well, do something that makes you happy. That's why I've been working out. And that's why I've been vlogging. Vlogging makes me so happy. I don't care what anybody says. Just because you make money from it does not mean it won't make you happy. I swear, before I was making money, I used to do YouTube for free. And I love it. Like, it's something that can document memories and you can look back on them. My kids like to look back on vlogs and, you know, see where they were. And I like to do it too. I like to look back on, like, I look back on my weight loss videos, pregnancy videos, baby updates. I look back on all of that and I just be like, oh, my baby's growing up so fast. I don't know, this video is kind of all the way around. Um, that's why I started my herbal life as well, you guys, to help, um, you know, do something for myself. And I feel like this is a good way for me to feel so much better about myself. Feel happy in my skin that I'm in. Like lately, I've been feeling like crap. And I'm so close to the camera. I'm just so sorry. And back y'all up just a tap bit. I've been feeling like crap and I haven't wanted to be, haven't wanted to do my hair. I haven't wanted to get dressed. I don't even have makeup on right now. I haven't even been put, I haven't wanted to put makeup on, but some days I just be like, Jasmine, throw some little makeup on, make you feel good. But like today, I'm, I don't have no makeup on, but I'm still like, 
feeling myself type vibe. I'm actually in the middle of flat ironing my hair. But I'm kind of liking the bun at the top and in the back flat iron, you know what I'm saying? Nah, but I'm going to finish flat ironing. But like I said, um, take it day by day. Do what you can. Lately, I've been trying to make it easy on myself. Because I was at a point where I would try to do everything. Like, I would try to clean I would try to clean everything late at night and I would just be so exhausted. So lately, I, if I can do it at night, I'll do it. If I can't, I will actually wait the next day. The message is gonna be there till the next day. I mean, I hate going to sleep in a dirty house. That's just how I am. But lately, I just be like, Jasmine, you can only do so much. And I feel like not forcing so much on myself is making it so much easier on me. Sorry, I keep leaving my phone because it's lighting up. But, I mean, Philip isn't here. I can be doing worse. You know what I'm saying? Okay. People be like, oh, you're living with your mom. Okay. Okay. But I can be doing worse. You know what I'm saying? I can be, I'm not even, I'm not homeless. Because clearly I have a home. I could be living in my car. Or, you know what I'm saying? I could be doing real bad. But I'm not. And that's another thing I think about. I'd be like, I could be doing worse. It could be worse than this. My life could be more stressful. I can hate myself. But I'm actually loving myself. And I love my kids. So for the people that's just like, Jasmine, you living with your mom or your kids is this or that. People don't know what goes on in my day. I hate that. I see a lot of comments. People kind of judge me off what they see. You don't know what go on throughout the full day with Jasmine. You don't know, okay? They like, oh, you're so busy. You take, you're taking time out of your busy. Listen, sweetheart. What makes me busy is my kids. Not YouTube. YouTube doesn't make me busy because I put y'all on the back burner. When it comes to editing, I can go days without editing or days without vlogging. I will wait until I feel like I'm comfortable and I'm not so tired to edit sometimes. I put y'all on the back burner sometimes. But I have days that I have to just be like, okay, hurry up and get YouTube done. <sighs> hurry up and get YouTube done so I can get paid. It is not just getting paid from YouTube. I get paid from sponsorships. And like I can't just be like, you know, I'm gonna just stop it all because right now this is the money I'm making. I'm making it off of here. And for people to be like, Jasmine, you need to get a real job, that stresses me out, bruh. Because I'm just like, nigga, don't you think I will work a real job if I could? I got twins and I got a freaking toddler. Of course, a might go to school next year, thank the Lord. But like I said, I still got twins. It's not like paying for one kid in daycare. I would pay double. And that, that's a lot of fucking money. I'm sorry. I just can't sit here and just throw my money away um, to daycare. And also, people like, well, why don't you get daycare assistance? I explained this several times. I explained this years ago, and I explained it again this recently. I cannot get daycare assistance anymore. I... They said that they, I never reported my address change, so I cannot get it no more, okay? I would love to get it because it was really cheap. I was paying roughly $170 for two kids. Um, I can't get that no more because they said, oh, you never reported your address change when you moved to Round Rock. It was a whole bunch of junk and I tried to appeal it. It was my word against hers. And I lost, okay? And I cannot get it. When I was in clean, I was able to actually get it. I hate that I didn't apply for it once I was working in clean, and I should have, but. And the only reason why I did not apply for it is because during the day, um, I would watch the kids while Philip went to work. And then at nighttime, of course, Philip would watch the kids while I went to work. And it was just, you know, we was able to switch off and I didn't need daycare at that time. But now I'm kind of regretting it. I wish I would have got it. But hey, this is now. And Amaya goes to school next year. So I'm not really tripping. I think it's because Colleen is a smaller community. And um, everything is just there. You know what I'm saying? And you can, you have your own personal caseworker. It's just, it's a small community, period. Austin, I'm telling y'all, when I go into that workforce place, it's hectic and I just was like oh my god what the fuck am I gonna do but Colleen you go into it it's like a small office me it's like a home that's what it looked like to me a home it's somebody's house they're running a business out of their house 
So for the ones that were questioning, I cannot get it because they saying that I owe five thousand dollars. Five thousand because of the address change. They had me all the way jacked up. I mean, I might, I might try to appeal it again just to see that I might give it a try. But like I said, you guys. I'm feeling better about myself and I feel like I just want to come on here and talk to y'all and let y'all know that I'm doing good and a lot of y'all are like jazz a lot of vloggers y'all are seeing are pre-recorded so I'm sorry and people be like why are you putting up videos that are old because some people are asking for them and why wouldn't I you know what I'm saying I will let you know at the beginning of the video if the video is old you know what I'm saying and I'll put the date the timestamp I will timestamp it at the beginning of the video sometimes the time the actual time is wrong because I need to change my settings because time changed so um with that said I just wanted to let you guys know that those videos are old even the videos I did with like the way my meal prepping it's just stuff before the Herbalife is old okay <laughs> I felt like I had to come on here and talk to y'all and explain everything because I just got tired of people asking me questions and I was repeating, repeatedly answering the questions in the comment section. I was just like, how about I pin it? That didn't work. How about I just make a video and then if someone asks, I'll link it. I feel like that's so much easier. Um, like I said, Phil goes to court on the 20th and hopefully he gets some kind of something. We find something out. I mean, him here or him, him not, him here or him not, I mean, only difference would be out of the break. You know what I'm saying? It's not like it's going to make a difference. Um, it would be easier with two incomes. We've actually been talking about, um, we got some shit. We're cooking some shit up, y'all. And it's more to do with social media. And y'all, I'm not going to say it because I don't need nobody to be like, oh, I never thought of that. You know what I'm saying? But just know. Our grind is gonna be good, okay? And the ones that don't like Philip, I'm sorry, you don't like him. I'm so sorry, but he's not your man. Point blank, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, thumbs up this video, subscribe if you are new, and if you are new, welcome to the fam. We love you guys. Don't forget to check out our previous videos, and we'll catch y'all later. Bye, boo.